Hi everybody, it's Feb. I'm just outside of solitude, as you can see, down at the docks on this beautiful morning. And I've come to see the Underwater Palace Dimensional Home. And you pick up a globe. I found it just in here on the shelf, fittingly next to the cheese. <laughs> and when you pick up the globe, it goes into your potions, just like Ivy Temple, Creekside Manor, and many others. And there it is. Click on that gives you a little health boost and then in you go to this oh my goodness mind-bogglingly colorful place under the sea so this is your entrance hall and your means of exit so you can go back to where you came from by clicking on that and you'll get a new globe in your inventory or you can go to all of these places and I just love the use of these little Dwemer columns. Really nice. So lots of travel options. And the home itself. Fascinating. Look at this structure. It's almost like um, we have a place over here called Project Eden with these bio globes. And that's kind of what it reminds me of. This is really something. Okay, so this is your entrance and then you've got choices. You go left or right, past these amazing colorful displays. Off to the left is your living quarters. Very nice sitting area. The views are something else. And as you go further down in the globes, they get even better. The detail out there is really something. It's a fascinating place. See the mud crab burying himself in the sand. So here's your kids, room for four. And I am in love with these little candle globes. Those are so pretty, I want them in real life. And you'll find them all about the house and they're all in different colours. Really quite spectacular. And I just love these little flower troughs at the end of each bed. Look at these like peace lily type things, they are amazing. And you get a real 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea vibe from here, you know, with the sounds in here. <laughs> and then down to your bedroom. Look out there, though. That is nice looking armour. Weapon storage, all of the usual things that you'd expect to find. When I say that, you know, Mentha always does this. Beautiful storage. And your bed, which looks really super comfortable. Nice thick mattress. Look at the scroll box, that is so pretty. I love these views. You just never know what she's going to do next. <laughs> 
So that is awesome. <laughs> Look at the mechanics of the thing. It's obviously been really carefully thought through. Everything makes sense, you know? <laughs> it's almost like it's pumping air in. Oops. Big dining area. I love how you can see into the other globes. And here's your cooking area, and look at the sink! <laughs> This tiny little spigot on the end. There's your cooking pot. And an oven and these gorgeous hanging baskets. And then down into your workroom and it's all here in one spot. Oh, look at that lamp. There's mannequins, wood chopping block, enchanter alchemy, staff enchanter, beautiful looking potion bottles. I love those. So all of your smithing covered here too, look. Amazing. This place has got it all. That looks like a sunken treasure chest down there. <laughs> it's, got, it's got potions. And just like the Ivy Temple, it makes you want to go outside and explore, doesn't it? I feel like I should have a diving suit hanging up somewhere. <laughs> this is so lovely. Oh look, there's even plants on the outside, like water reeds and things. Oh, I hadn't noticed that before. Well, I don't even know what my favorite feature of this home is. <laughs> she makes it hard. Well, <laughs> that's an amazing view. Okay, well, I'll leave you with that picture then. I'll call that the end of this video, and I will see you soon for another.